We don't have it. We can cause any explosion. Any little happening at the level of competence <coughs> may blow off. And that is what is happening. In fact, if you look at the way you know, we are going ahead today, you know, this relationship between husband and wife, what do you think? Is it now based on trust on intention unconditionally or doubt on intention? In fact, today, if you, you know, look at the way the husband and the wife will talk to each other, it's almost like they are at war. <laughs> so if a wife asks the husband, what are you doing? And the husband says, you, do, you will not understand. And then the wife is busy trying to prove that he does not understand anything. <laughs> That's the way they are. It is. I remember this story about Hindan Asribin. So one of his friends came to his house and he had a drawing room which was just glass, you know. Made of glass. So it was quite rigid. Mm -hmm. So when he was just coming, he saw it, you know, one uh, plate coming in the air and the mullah just saved himself. So by the time this guest came inside and he asked Mullah, what is Mullah, everything fine? He said, yes, yes, everything is very fine. We are both very happy. So the guest said, I don't feel so, that you are both very happy. He said, no, 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 it is very simple. When my wife throws this plate on me, right, and it hits me, she feels happy. <laughs> when I am able to save myself, I feel happy. <laughs> and, and this is the way both are happy. <laughs> so this <laughs> So this is the way both are happy. <laughs> so now if you look at the relationship between husband and wife, between the father and the son, right? You can see whether there is trust on intention or serious doubt on intention. And all these so-called developed families, you know. If you look at the timetable of the child, you know, son and the father, the son will get up in the morning, only after the father has left for the office. So no meeting, right? Mm -hmm. When the father has left for the office, he will get up at 12 o'clock, take bath, <coughs> take food and then go out. Right? And come back only by the time the father has left. Yeah. <laughs> and if they have to convey anything to each other, they will convey to the mother. <laughs> <laughs> tell him this. And he will also say, tell him this. <laughs> So that's where we are, you know. All that explosion is taking place because, because of the lack of trust on intention. Competence is anyway missing. <laughs> but because of the trust on intention, there is no acceptance, you know, of the other as being related to you. And therefore, if you don't have that acceptance, you are not working on the improving the competence of yourself and the other. All the time keep complaining. All the time you keep complaining. This man is doing that, you know, and doing this. Right? Not trying to improve upon the competence. I'll share this story in our group. Whether it's true or not true, we can never verify. Realize things. Realize things. And he had tons of sponsors. And maybe after how many years, sponsor decided to go with the other realized thing. And the attendant, the people said, uh, after your person had left with someone else, what? Can you after some time? And the attendant reported, yes, I can come back. Why? We take it up after the break. <laughs> <laughs>